So this is kind of the back side of our house. And it runs tight to this abandoned woodlawn in community inn or something. So the community woodlawn inn here is abandoned and it's in between our house and the street. It also says 1427, which is our address. Septic crosses property line, not certified. Failed inspection. Many other issues get the facts. Our driveway is on the other side of the house. This is the Woodlawn Community Inn parking lot and basketball hoop. Behind our house is also another house pretty close. So there's not much privacy. The roof looks decent. There is some minor spots. Like right here. Looks like something. Otherwise it looks alright. Looks like there's some spots that are different color there too. So this is our gravel driveway. And what I'd say is the front door and front porch. Here's that abandoned place. That, like I said, it's in between us and the road. It's a real nice, quiet street. Barely any traffic. It's waterfront down that way. Arena across the road from us but this inn is definitely an eyesore and there's not much uh, privacy because of the houses the way they're set up one two three of them back here front porch pretty sturdy, the railing just needs some work. Through this front entrance, stairs down, and then an open living dining kitchen area. Drywall's in pretty good shape. There's a lot of textured ceiling though. Kitchen's good size. Or it can at least be made bigger. There's an electric panel. Looks in pretty good shape. Pretty new. It's a 200 amp panel. And back here. It's the back exit. Right here is where I did see a little bit of water damage in the roof, but for the most part it looks alright. It's hard to see this side of the roof. And the bedroom back here. Two sunroofs. So it's this side. And then back towards the front door, there's a bedroom off to the side here. Windows look like they're old single panel, or maybe double panel. I, keep I think they're double paneled windows, but they're pretty old. Another bedroom connected here. Last room didn't have a closet, 
This one has a good size closet. Pretty big. And this bedroom goes through to the kitchen. And the last thing we just full bath. This is a good size bathroom. New fixtures, and it's all PVC plumbing in this house. And then last, the basement, which is a really small area. Not finishable by ceiling height. It's like 6'3, six, 6'4. Six, Kind of an open area, and then back here is the utilities sump. Hot water heater is in pretty good shape. PVC plumbing. I need a new HVAC unit. And then back here they had a room finished. And the rest that way is like a crawl space. <clears throat> That's it. Let's also wash our dryer hook up down here.